Okay guys, so I'm going to send y'all with some instructions via video on how to finish your printmaking project. First you're going to pick out your picture of an animal which will be hanging up on the clothesline area in the classroom. You can pick this one or your own. You're going to have to draw it yourself onto your piece of paper with the rectangle drawn on it. And again, you're going to be using this block of paper, this block um, for that, for the animal, and you're going to be using the round one with your name. That's going to be a different stamp with the rubber. We did this one in class. We're going to do this one for tomorrow in art studio. Pick your animal. Draw it out onto your paper, which looks like this. Draw your picture. Choose the one you like the best. Do the same thing we did in class and transfer it onto your stamp. Then you're going to use the tools in the classroom, in the back of the classroom, to carve out your design. When you're finished and you're ready to print, you're going to get a blank sheet of paper as a work surface to keep your area clean. You're going to take your stamp and you're going to get your ink ready. Put it into one of these plastic trays and you can throw away the plastic tray with the ink when everyone is finished. You're going to gently roll on top of the stamp with the ink and make sure it's completely covered. Your paper underneath is giving you protection. You're going to take your stamp and place it how you want it. You're going to have four sheets of paper, two for each stamp. You're going to place it in the center, gently place it down and push to make sure the ink is stayed on. Then you're going to take your burnishing tool, burnish all areas and make sure everything has been touched and has absorbed the ink under the paper. Again, the paper is on top, the stamp is underneath, and then you're going to pull it off of the stamp, and here's your finished project. You're going to try to stay neat, do another one if you need to. Take this and let it dry. You need two of the rectangle stamp and two of the round stamp. Call me if you have any questions and make sure to clean up all your mess. I have things that you can use to clean up any ink and make sure you use protection over your clothing. See you later.